This is Robo and Kala, the world's thinnest and lightest 2-in-1 laptop that has flagship-grade specifications with a Snapdragon 8CX Gen 3 processor at the core, and I found this device to be versatile, smooth, and fun to use. At the moment, it is on a Kickstarter campaign that is coming to an end, so make sure to check out the links and show notes in the video description if you want to get it at an early bird price of $799 US. First of all, let's do a quick unboxing. I have the set that helps unleash the full potential of the device and that includes the keyboard and the smart pen. The tablet comes in a pretty nice looking box and inside it you can find a 65W fast charger, USB Type-C cable and some paperwork. The Robo and Kala is a rather new product to the market and to be honest with you, I didn't expect the build quality to be this good. It is on par or even better than the most expensive tablets out there. The device is made entirely out of metal and it is constructed like the top-notch flagship. For comparison, here is how it looks like next to the 11-inch iPad Pro. The build quality might be even better and the rounded edges make it more comfortable to hold in the hand. It feels that you are holding a quality piece of kit that is built to last. I also love this green color which is subtle, solid, yet it stands out from the crowd from silver or black colors that are mostly used in this category of devices. The Robo and Kala is 7.3mm thin and it weighs 690 grams, which makes it the thinnest and lightest 2-in-1 laptop in the world. The 12.6-inch display is one of the nicest I've seen on a tablet. It uses a 2.5K resolution AMOLED panel with 600 nits of brightness and 98% DCI-P3 wide color gamut. The result of this, excellent quality screen that is tech sharp, the colors are punchy yet natural and the panel is simply beautiful to look at. My personal favorite feature, a robust metal-made kickstand that can be adjusted in a variety of ways for both productivity and entertainment. It uses high-quality hinges that can withstand thousands of bends. On the right and left sides, you can find a pair of speakers that offer pretty good sound quality. There are also two USB Type-C 3.2 ports that offer high transfer speeds and support video output. On the top, you can find a set of mics. On the bottom, there are pogo pins for keyboard connection. And on the back, there is a 13 megapixels camera that can record 4K video. The tablet is completely silent thanks to the fanless design. Instead, it uses heat pipes and a passive graphene cooling system. During my test, it got just a little bit warm but not too hot. My hands always felt comfortable holding it. The keyboard is very nice. It is well constructed and it has a nice backlight for night typing sessions. I like the spacing, travel distance, the keys are clicky and responsive, there is no wobble or flexing and overall, it offers great and fast typing experience. The trackpad deserves a lot of praise too. It is responsive and comfortable to use for browsing the web or doing any other stuff. You can also use the supplied stylus for the touchscreen to do the same stuff as you would do with your fingers, but if you like drawing or taking notes or handwriting, you'll definitely find it useful. Once you are done using it, you can conveniently store it on the side of the tablet thanks to the strong built-in magnet and it will start charging wirelessly at the same time. Just one minute of charging provides two hours of usage. It never ran out of battery for me yet. Once you fold the keyboard, you get a very portable yet fully functioning Windows 11 laptop which is convenient for traveling. Take the main unit out of the keyboard and you'll have a tablet with a massive 12.6 inch superb quality touchscreen display. You can also attach the tablet upside down and you can use it with the keyboard in a tablet mode. Attaching the tablet to the keyboard is super fast and easy thanks to strong magnets. If you don't like the keyboard attached to the tablet, you can still use it wirelessly thanks to the built-in Bluetooth, which is super convenient. The Robo and Kala comes with a Windows 11 pre-installed. In addition to the super fast and efficient Snapdragon 8 CX Gen 3 processor, my unit has 16GB of RAM and 512GB of fast SSD storage. I found day-to-day -day performance to be near excellent. The device feels fast and responsive pretty much all the time. 
I'm not a big gamer, but I found that the device performs great in titles like Asphalt 9 and I'm pretty sure that it has enough power to handle other games as well. Other daily tasks like browsing the web, social media, editing documents work like a breeze. Very smooth overall performance. Battery life is one of the highlights of this device. You can get up to 20 hours on a single charge if you use the device mostly for video or other non-demanding stuff. That means that you can use the Robo and Kala for several days and leave the home without a charger with peace of mind. I found Wi-Fi 6 connectivity and range to be excellent in my apartment and Bluetooth 5.2 works fine with all of the devices I tested the laptop with. All things considered, Robo and Kala is an excellent quality 2-in-1 laptop that I've enjoyed using for several weeks now. It pretty much ticks all the boxes to be called a flagship grade device. The design and build are top notch, the display is amazing, the performance is very good and the device is super versatile thanks to the detachable keyboard, built-in kickstand and the smart pen. To sum up, Robo and Kala exceeded my expectations by a large margin and I can definitely recommend you to check it out if you want a high quality all-in-one productivity and entertainment device. What do you think about the Robo and Kala? Would you buy this device or would you choose another option? As always, like the video if you liked it, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and as always, it was Linus, thank you for watching and see you soon.